Good evening and welcome to the Big Bang. I'm Nolan Pinto. In the backdrop of the state celebrating the biggest festival of democracy, many young people today voted for the first time. News 9 brings to you the mood of Yangistan. Take a look. Enthusiastic first time voters exercise their franchise. For many, voting has been a dream. Seeing their parents vote, they have been waiting for the day when their vote makes a difference in the world's largest democracy. Today, many enthusiastic first-time voters exercise the right to vote for the first time. News 9 caught up with a few debutant voters from Namba Bengaluru and the excitement soared. I'm Rachna. Okay, so how do you feel voting for the very first time? You've been uh, seeing your parents vote for so I've many times. I wanted to vote uh, because whenever I was, uh, you know, a small, uh, I used to see my parents go and vote. And they wouldn't allow me in the voting room, but I would just go stand there looking at them. And it was always exciting because I didn't know what it was at that time. But it, it made me uh, always believe that I had to vote someday. And uh, my mom and dad, they always, uh, they're very uh, concerned about what goes on in this country. And that's probably influenced me now. So I'm very uh, much interested in doing something for the country and a vote. So your vote is going to count today. Your one vote is going to be important today. So how do you feel about that? It's important. Everyone's vote is important. It's for the country. Every vote counts. Like uh, Mother Teresa said, every drop in the ocean counts. And now we found Vag Devi who's voting for the first time. Vag Devi, how old are you? I'm just 18 years. And you have voted for the first time. How does it feel? You know, you're a part of this great democracy and you know, how does it feel? I'm so excited and I'm very happy that I've completed my duty towards my country. All right. I'm feeling very responsible today. All right. Have you got your driver's license? No, not yet. But you do have a voter's ID card and you exercise your vote. That is amazing. I think you should show our viewers the thumb that you have. What are your hopes for the governance? I wish for a good government which serves people and keep up their promises and whatever Ashwasan is they give. All right, thank you so much. I wanted to go see the candidates for myself and make my own decision. So we've been at loggerheads, but <laughs> I made my, the choice was mine entirely. Okay, so you're a first time voter. You've seen your father vote since your childhood. So how do you feel to be a first time voter? It, it's really important that all the first time voters go out and vote this time. Because now, for the first time, we've got social media. We've got so many tools to help us in the voting process. It's not like we are not mobilized anymore. It's a mixed uh, sentiment. Yeah, of course, I want to vote for my right. Uh, at the same time, there are good candidates this time. So, yeah, it's a great feeling. It's the first time, so it was a great experience. Now I'm be heading to celebrate this experience. <laughs> oh. While young voters in Bengaluru earnestly voted for the candidate of their choice, News 9 also caught up with first-time voters from various parts of the state. And there, too, it was just smiles all over. I'm going to vote for the candidate person a choice mod bodo nan votes right en ide torse bodo anta on chance ikta sir eno sir ega sir tumba khushi aagta ide ee day ge wait martide so first election tumba khushi aitu sir youth kayalli ide namma bhavishya nam deshuddu anta adanne ankondivi namma institutions allo hange namge helisi heli belisidare nave kaapadbeku munde anta heli ade tara naavu ivaga namge hakku bandide first time vote martidivi ivaga namma prakara naavu ondu valle abhyarthine naavu chunaisidivi so avre gelbeku anta namma nirikshe ide ನಮ್ಮ ಸಿಟಿಜನ್ ರೈಟ್ ಆದಮೇಲೆ ನಾವು ವೋಟ್ ಮಾಡಲೇಬೇಕು ಮೂರು ದಿನ ರಜಾ ಇದೆ ಅಂತ ಹೋಗಿ ಸುತ್ತಾಡೋದಲ್ಲ ಒಂದ್ ಹತ್ತು ನಿಮಿಷ ಟೈಮ್ ಸ್ಪೆಂಡ್ ಮಾಡೋದ್ರಲ್ಲಿ ಏನು ತಪ್ಪಾಗಲ್ಲ ವೋಟ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಒಂದ್ ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಪ್ರಜೆ ಬೇಕು ನಮಗೆ ನಮ್ಮ ದೇಶ ನಡೆಸುವಂತ ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಪ್ರಜೆ ನಮ್ಮ ಸಿಟಿನ ನೋಡ್ಕೊಂಡು ಈ ಡೆವಲಪ್ಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಮಾಡೋಂತ ಒಂದ್ ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಪ್ರಜೆ ಬೇಕು ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ನಾನು ವೋಟ್ ಮಾಡಿದೀನಿ ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಪ್ರಜೆ ಸೆಲೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಗ್ತಾರೆ ಅನ್ನೋ ನಂಬಿಕೆ ಇದೆ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಟೈಮ್ ವೋಟ್ ಮಾಡುವಾಗ ನಮ್ಮ ಎಕ್ಸೈಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಇತ್ತು ಯಾಕಂದ್ರೆ ಹಳೆ ಕಾಲದಲ್ಲಿ ಐ ಮೀನ್ ಏನ್ಷಿಯನ್ ಟೈಮ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ನಮ್ಮ ಪೇರೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಎಲ್ಲ ವೋಟ್ ಮಾಡಕ್ ಹೋಗ್ತಿದ್ರು ಅವಾಗ ನಮ್ಗೆ ಅನ್ಸ್ತಿತ್ತು ನಮ್ ವೋಟಿಂಗ್ ರೈಟ್ ಯಾವಾಗ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಅಂತ ಸೊ ಇಷ್ಟೊಂದ್ ವರ್ಷ ಕಾದಾದ್ಮೇಲೆ ನನ್ ವೋಟಿಂಗ್ ರೈಟ್ ಬಂದಿರೋದ್ನ ಅದನ್ನ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಲ್ ಆಗಿ ಯೂಸ್ ಮಾಡೋ ರೈಟ್ ನಂದು ಕಾಸ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ದೇ ವೋಟ್ ಟುಡೇ ಯಂಗಸ್ತಾನ್ ಇಸ್ ಪ್ರೌಡ್ ಟು ಕಾಂಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಶೇರ್ ದ ಬಿಗೆಸ್ಟ್ ಫೆಸ್ಟಿವಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಡೆಮೋಕ್ರಸಿ and all of them are hoping for the best candidate to come to power a new snine report well many luminaries today took some time off from their schedule their busy schedule that is to cast their vote today and news 9 which has been bringing you continuous reports from ground zero caught up with many celebrities exercising their franchise do take a look 
stars form beeline in polling booths. Many luminaries today exercise their franchise in various parts of the state. In Bengaluru, film stars sizzled all the way as many noted actors from Sandalwood cast their vote. Ramesh Arvind, Bharti Bishnuvardhan, Jagesh, Dunya Vijay, Dwarkesh, Shruti and Hema Chaudhary were among the many celebrity voters. Sandalwood first family cast their vote. The Rajkumars, widely known as Sandalwood's first family, cast their vote at Sadashiv Nagar today. Pavastar Puneet Rajkumar, his brother Raghavendra Rajkumar and the late actor's wife Parvatama Rajkumar exercised their franchise. News 9 caught up with Puneet Rajkumar on the occasion and this is what the past star had to say. One of the most influential families in Sadashiv Nagar has to be the Rajkumar family and I have with me Puneet Rajkumar who just cast his vote. Let's ask Mr. Puneet. Puneet, uh, you are one of the well-known faces in this area and um, how do you persuade your friends and family to actually exercise their birthright and their democratic right? Being a responsible citizen, I've, uh, I've advertised for the voting committee then been requesting through all the media wherever I've been asked to tell. So I think it's important to vote. And it is necessary to vote. Okay. How is the situation like now? The things kind of change when your own family members are contesting the election this time. So, uh, do you face uh, a lot of questions from other people as to whether you're being biased or whether you're actually, you know, no, actually, selling it? I've been clear from the day one that, you know, of course, uh, my sister in law's uh, got into uh, politics and it's her will and wish, my brother's family's will and wish. And uh, I definitely wish her all the best. And uh, uh, I've never campaigned, so I've not gone to it. Okay. You are known as the power star of Sandalwood. Uh, give a powerful message to all the Bangaloreans and uh, Indians out there that how, why they should exercise this important right of theirs. No, if it's if I've been titled the power star, it's the power what is given to me is by the public. So I've told them again, and I've been here telling them repeatedly, please vote. Yeah. While most members of Rajkumar family cast their vote in the morning, Shiv Rajkumar and wife Geeta, who is contesting polls from Shumoga constituency exercise their franchise later in the evening. Golden Star Ganesh too cast his vote from Putin Harley constituency. Accompanied by his wife, Ganesh was one of the early voters at the polling booth. The fame actor spoke to News 9 and said that he was happy to see a better turnout this time around. Well, Golden Star Ganesh and his wife have just cast their vote here in JP Nagar. They have come out and we'll talk to them. Well, first of all, a very encouraging queue here. Yeah, yeah. I felt very happy when I came early morning here. Last time the crowd was not so much, uh, queue was not so big queue. But today at morning, early morning queue is very big, so I felt very happy. So I request all the uh, people to come out of the house and uh, vote your rights. Well, Ma'am, are you a regular voter? Have you voted several times before? Of course, we never miss out on this chance. And uh, I'm very glad and very happy to see that uh, the turnout is really good. In fact, uh, everywhere in India the turnout has been very good this time. It's a good sign and I request each, well, each one of them to come out and vote. Would you say something to your fans on this day? They would tell Ache Bandhu, vote Madi, Belik Belik Nanu Kuda vote Madi Dini. Don't miss your rights, please vote. Sandalwood actor Jaimala also exercised her franchise today at Sanjanagar. Speaking to News 9, Jaimala said that it was the right of every citizen to cast their vote. Now, everybody knows uh, Dollars Colony is a very popular area in Bengaluru and it's also popular because it has uh, eminent sandalwood actress Jaimala living in that area. I have with me the actress herself, uh, Mr. Jaimala, you have come here to uh, cast your vote. How do you feel about this? A very special feeling to exercise a democratic right, isn't it? Of course. This is uh, my rights, actually. I'm very happy that uh, I voted Congress <laughs> and I'm very happy. And I am, uh, I'll request the uh, entire Bangalore, entire Karnataka people, please vote for, uh, please vote yourself. Sandalwood actor Radhika Pandit also cast a vote from Gayatri Nagar today. Another star who came out to exercise this franchise was actor Kitcha Sudhi. The famed actor cast his vote from JP Nagar. Challenging star Darshan also cast his vote today from Rajarajeshwari Nagar. Celebrities heckled by EVM malfunction. Many people have been unable to cast their votes this election due to many reasons such as omission of names from list, technical snags and so on. Even celebrities were not spared. 
Sandalwood star Pranita Subhash, who was also to cast a vote for the first time, faced some serious trouble when the EBMs in a polling booth were hit by technical snag. Polling is done there, but the uh, machine work at the end of the day, so one hour ago is done. So my hopes are done there because uh, this is the end of the day. You know, I was really keen to vote, and uh, but you know, my luck is so machine problem is there. So much of that, but I hope there are no. After some delay, the actor was finally able to cast a vote. She said that she was happy to exercise the franchise for the first time. Yeah, very happy to be here at uh, at the polling booth, and I'm done with my voting, and I've contributed to to the country. I feel like that. Nagati Halli Chandrasekhar, a noted director, also faced problems while casting his vote in Panchankari. Although the problem was rectified, many people were stalled from exercising their rights for quite some time. News 9 caught up with Chandrasekhar and this is what he had to say. The other very important thing, it's very nice to see the people with the pride face. Only one day in their life, probably. I hope this pride should continue. For lifetime, unfortunately, voter will have the pride for a day. The next, you know, till the election comes, he is like a beggar. He is like a, a wandering between the tables, wandering between office to office to get it done his work. All sort of, uh, you know. In that sense, people call it matadana. I say it's not matadana. It's, it's not right to use word dana. It's Mata Chalavane, we are casting our vote. So that should be the approach and the meaning of uh, casting the vote. And other very important thing, this time I am very happy to see the uh, huge crowd, which was not there in the earlier election. Yesh casts a VIP vote. While most of the actors patiently stood in the queue with other voters to exercise their franchise, actor Yash cast his vote like a VIP. Yash was seen jumping the queue and directly walked into the polling booth while people were left waiting. Many luminaries also cast their vote. Film stars apart, many noted personalities were also spotted at the ballot booths today. Former Loka Ikta Justice Santosh Hegde, noted writer and Gyan Peter Wadi Professor U R Anant Murthy, noted theatre artist Master Hiranaya and Mohandas Pai were some of the luminaries who exercised their franchise today. Karnataka's Chief Electoral Officer Anil Kumar Jha has also cast his vote. Bengaluru Police Commissioner Raghavendra Aurat Karshtu was a luminary who cast his vote today. On the whole, it was a starry election in Bengaluru. While many celebrities have taken time off their busy schedules to exercise their franchise, the overall voter turnout in the city seems disappointing. A News 9 report.